nothing else has really happened this month except for the fact, you know, I played Hitman, I checked out E3, I was actually kind of disappointed in Microsoft, they're doing some sort of Nazi shit with the DRM and, and the used game issue and blah blah blah. Sony came out the gate and pretty much took a huge piss on Microsoft about that kind of shit. And, uh, but still at the same time, um, both of them are selling pipe dreams, they're selling stories. We still don't really have all the facts about what console that we should invest ourselves in. And another thing is that we don't really have uh, information about all the facts. We, we really don't have all the facts. They're, they're just telling us fantasy. They're just telling us shit that we want to hear, you know. I mean, Sony released their console, then Microsoft released their console, and then Sony at E3 basically, you know, they didn't want to show their hand when they revealed their console, which is very slick. I have to say, that is very, very slick. From a marketing standpoint, and, you know, I mean, really, they, they waited for Microsoft to go ahead and shoot themselves in the foot. And then, you know, Sony just came in and, you know, it's like, don't worry. If that thing with Microsoft is pissing you off, then, well, you can always go with us. You know, very slick, Sony. Very fucking slick. But still, when it comes to the Microsoft and the... Um, uh, you know, when it comes to the Xbox One and when it comes to the, you know, the PlayStation 4, we still don't have all of the necessary facts that we need in order, in order for us to make a, um, shit, I'll be right back. I'm back, accidentally locked my mom outside the house. <laughs> uh, man. So, yeah, that's all I really got to say about, like, the uh, console wars and everything. We really don't have all the facts yet. And they got this shit where it's like, you know, you want to go ahead and reserve. Um, you know, do you want to reserve a, a PlayStation Now? Or do you want to reserve a um, Xbox One Now? Which... In my humble opinion, I think that would be a bad mistake for any consumer to go out there and reserve anything at this point. Huge fucking mistake. Don't do not do sh No. No. Not until you get all of the facts that you need about each and every console. I mean, you obviously know about Microsoft's con. But don't let the cons cancel you out on the pros. But here's the thing, when it comes to Microsoft, we don't really know about their pros. That kind of sucks. We know about Sony's pros, but we don't really know that much about their cons. If Sony has any cons with their new console in the first place, and... I'm pretty sure it does have some cons because there's pros and cons to every console that you get. So, um, only thing I can say is that until you get all your facts, do not reserve anything. Nothing. 